Okay guys, welcome back to Ebony with Genghis on server 68. So I'm actually borrowing a friend's account right now just because I have something I want to show you guys. So I want to talk about the new event and it's this event right here at the bottom, the Rise of the Plantagenet Dynasty. So it's located right here on the map or on your in your hive right here that's where I just clicked so I'll go back into it and basically you get all these rewards right as you go down if you do not coin you do not spend any money you can only win the rewards on this side on the left right but there's still some good rewards so you get some golden keys and with the golden keys you can basically kind of spin the wheel of fortune type thing or the same as the general fragments and you will possibly win some awards but you can win worse awards rewards than this you don't always get these and as you go down you know you can get I'm clicking on the right here but you can see there's some much better rewards if you do spend a little bit of money okay you don't have to spend too much but if you go down on the if you're just continuing on the left you're getting kind of lower end rewards but when you go to the right you're going to get things like a lot of rune stones 15 stamina we can always use that you're going to get the chariot march i've seen that with a few people on the server it uh, looks pretty cool i'm looking forward to it myself you'll get some badges and then at the very end you will get a european epic historic general okay so that is awesome and if you go into the general hall and you look at the european generals there's a lot of really good epic european ones so i'm looking forward to this you could win a roland he's one of the best mounted generals you could win this is who i really want i really want alfred or scipio or Simeon but I'd settle for a Karis or an Athelfade however you say her name or even Roland I would be happy with anyone like that Harold's pretty decent uh, he's not great but uh, you know it's better than if you go over to someone like America and most of these guys are now obsolete and useless so at least Europe has some of the better ones there's also a neat little guy I think he's here Skanderberg yeah he's the hospital duty officer so there's some cool guys so that is excellent now if we go back into the event and it will tell you okay so right here I'm gonna click on the right here on the unlock part so I'm gonna click that and this will tell you how much you have to pay so I'm in Canada so this is Canadian dollars I'd be paying seven dollars or twenty eight dollars depending what country you're in that will change but basically you can read here you can decide for yourself you can only purchase once though so most people do make the media the 28 purchase just to ensure that they're going to complete it and when you do you automatically shoot up to level so you automatically shoot up to level 15 it is i believe so right here and then after that you start earning points and the way you earn points is by following these quests and completing these and lots of these are very similar just to what you do in the uh, king's path and gathering events and other events like that in the game so it is a neat little thing now one uh interesting little thing that did happen was if you go to the forge and this guy's forge is over here earlier this morning there was a ring and it was this ring it was the plantagenet ring okay now if you look at the base of this range troop attack 25 and then you look at the Achaemenidae ring which many people use on their archer generals range troop attack 20 so that's an improvement and then if you also go to upgrade can this guy upgrade oh i don't know if on his 
Yeah, so he doesn't have the option to look at the upgrade because he doesn't have a high enough forge. So I'll have to tease him a little bit about that. But anyways, so you could see that this ring has more archer attack. I could uh, just go to general list and see someone else's uh, general and see if anyone has that ring. But most people don't have the heir's ring on, so I couldn't compare. But the Achaemenidae, so one of the biggest questions I have, first of all, is how do we get it? They haven't told us. And then they updated the game again this morning and they removed it again from the forge. Now, how do we get it? But also, if it has 5% more attack than the Ayers and Achaemenidae rings, will it also have 5% more refining cap? That's a major question. So that will uh, be a deciding factor, I think, for a lot of people if they are debating whether it's worth it to change their rings if they have really good refines already on the other gear. Now, now I'm going to go into some rumors about how you can get this gear, the scroll. So this is from Reddit. It appears to be a scroll drop from bosses. Exactly which bosses? I'm not sure, but I'd guess something like a big B-15. If you went into the forge not long after the announcement, you scrolled right on the rings, selected the ring, it shows all the materials, and then if you click on the scroll, it says a drop from boss monsters, but it doesn't tell you which boss monsters. So that's one rumor. Then there's this rumor on the Ebony Wikipedia page. It says complete the quest. But when you go into the quest, it's not located there. All you see at the end is the epic European general. Now, one of my friends today completed the, this. He, uh, the, you can complete it early just by paying gems. Uh, and some, for some people, it's worth it. If they're busy and they can't uh, do all the activities, they just pay the gems and they complete it. Anyways, if you look at the top right here, on the upgrade so he's completed he has nothing left to grab here but it has a red dot right there i circled it for you so that red dot insinuates that there's something else to claim so maybe when the entire event's over they will give us the scroll if you completed it we don't know we're all just left so now there's one final thing i wrote customer support today and asked where do we get the scroll and i received a reply from them and uh, this guy told me he was the guy to talk to. So Kenneth gave me an answer, and I'll read it to you. This is a classic CS response, so I'm sure uh, you guys will get a kick out of this. Thank you for contacting Ebony's customer support. To begin with, I hope you are taking good care of yourself and keeping safe. Blah, blah. Sorry to hear the about the inconvenience this has caused you. I believe I'm the right person who can help you with that. To know more information regarding the scroll, hit the scroll icon, then select Get. It will then provide you information how to get that specific scroll. In the event you need help or have questions in the future, do not hesitate to create a new ticket and we'd be more than glad to help. Thank you, Kenneth P. So yeah, thanks Kenneth P. That uh, solved none of my questions. But uh, good to know that you are the man to ask. So anyways, that is the new event. And I hope we're all uh, sitting at the edge of our seats, all wanting that ring. So let's hope we get some answers. This is uh, Genghis on server 68. Like, subscribe, leave a comment.